Hey, Voice Spears Falcons, Mr. Auto coming at you from my uh, my basement gym one more time. Today we're going to be doing some muscle strength and for some added resistance. I've got my, my backpack, my book bag here, loading up with some of my favorite heavy books. I've probably got about 15 pounds in here. Maybe you should start with maybe about five. You could always play around with how heavy that bag is. With this and all workouts that I make videos for, feel free to repeat, you know, and do several sets. So we're going to be doing some different exercises, going through them kind of quick. Feel free to go through and do them a second or third or fourth time even. Also, I want to mention, as always, warm up before you work out. Uh, three or five minutes of jumping jacks, walking up and down stairs. In fact, uh, before I forget, good cardio would be to just load up the backpack and do some stairs, get some some music on and take a little indoor hike or outdoor if it's safe and approved to do so. Lastly, before I get started, I want to mention my Clever page. I've been putting all these videos and all kinds of information on there. So if you have a computer available to you, you should be able to get to my Clever links and, and these videos and some other fun stuff. So, all right, let's get started with my backpack strength workout. Got this loaded up on my back. Cinched in pretty tight. I'm gonna start with the all important legs. Some lunges, taking a nice medium step forward. I can hang on to something for balance if I need to. I'm gonna go sideways now. Big key to lunges, not letting your knee get in front of your toe. It should stay over your foot. I want your back pretty straight. Another option, instead of lunges, would be squats. Again, the knees stay behind the toes. Try to keep your back fairly flat, your chest up. You don't want to lean forward too much. You have to a little bit. Always remember to breathe. Shooting for maybe 10 repetitions total between my lunges. And again, I can always come back and do more sets. Please, especially you powerhouses out there. Gonna go right to some push-ups. This makes it a little harder. And if this is too hard, you can just lose the backpack. Any of these exercises can be done without added weight. Keep your core tight, back straight. And let's say I did a set, I did some of those and feeling tired. I could keep going. It's called a drop set when you reduce the resistance. Or you could just start with these. My hands are on a bench, or a couch, or a heavy table. My head should go higher than where my hands are. Feeling that. All right, next couple exercises I'm gonna do, holding the backpack. I'm gonna go ahead and overlap my shoulder straps. And try to bring them around to the other side. I might have too many books for that. Gives me a handle, kind of a handle anyway. Now I'm gonna work my back muscles, rowing. Whew. Trying to get my upper body kind of flat like the floor or parallel. Of course, don't forget to work the other side. Or again, I could use a couch or a table. I'm gonna try this unzipping a pocket here for a change. Using that for my handle. The elbow goes nice and far back. Squeezing those rhomboids. And again, make sure to get both sides on this one. Last, I'm going to work my abs, uh, my abdominals. Gripping where I can. I use the handles again, I think. Back it up here. I'm going to twist, hold this out for my body and hold, squeezing in here. The farther you hold it out, the harder it is. 
this. It also works the shoulders a little. About five or ten each side. I should start to feel that. said before, I can go right back to my legs again. As always, well wishes to you and your families. Hope you're staying healthy and safe and still learning. Um, we'll talk to you soon. And again, if you haven't yet, check out that Clever page. It's got all kinds of stuff that I've got lined up for you. All right. Now, Otto Allen.